Hi, it's Will from StormTheCastle.com, and here on YouTube, you know me as Epic Fantasy, and this is my latest tutorial. This is a fast, easy cardboard castle project. This is the fastest, the easiest, and the best cardboard project you can get, I believe, because it's just so simple, but it comes out really good, and you can have a lot of fun doing all kinds of different things with this uh, project. So, uh, one box is all you need, some glue, you know, and of course, a ruler and a Knife. Dioramas, origami, cat, pulse, and treasure chase, telescopes, terrariums, bonsai trees, and paper games, swords and shields, and real blocks, fifteen, model boxes, animation. I teach you out of real creation. StormTheCastle.com. Let's make something. So you can use a, a lot of different boxes. Uh, save your boxes when you get them. Uh, fold them up and put them away. But look, here's one example of a box. I'm not going to use that box, but you know that one's rectangular, and you can use it. This one's about um, 14 by 14, I think. Yeah, 13 by 13, 13 by 14, and about nine and a half inches tall. This is the one I'm going to use, and I wanted to show you something real quick here. Now, I'm going to use that whole box all the way up to the top, but if your box is taller than you want to make, say, a 9 or 10 inch castle, you're just going to cut away uh, the top, you know, mark it up like this, and then cut away the top, and you practically got a castle. Look at that. Just like that. Mark it all the way around, use a template, and then take the top off, and look at that. You've already got the tassel. Then we'll use that top part to make the tower and the various structures that go inside. So the first thing you can do is cut away the flaps on the top of the box because we'll use those to make our keep or tower. You know, this project is part of my um, upcoming book on cardboard box projects, so watch for that. I got a whole bunch of really, really fun and interesting cardboard box projects you can make. I'm gonna, I'll let you all know when that book is published. But there we go, so we've got those flaps. Now, I made a template. You might want to make a template too, or you can just kind of freehand it and measure it. But there's a drawbridge there. We're going to use that for a door in the back of the castle too. And then all those crenellations um, are pretty much one inch squares. So I wanted to make it nice and uniform, so I made a template and then transferred that to all four sides of the box. But the doorway there, the main gate doorway drawbridge, only on the front and then on the back. So like I said, uh, those towers are three inches wide, then left and right, and then the crenellations are one inch squares. Yeah, pretty simple. I went ahead and marked it up more so you could see it more clearly. You know, I'm having a lot of fun with cardboard. I'm doing all kinds of cardboard projects. And hey, see, there you go. Isn't that look good? That's pretty much it. We're almost on it. We almost have our castle done. You can have this project done in less than an hour. And then you can do all kinds of detail work, and I'll show you some of the details that I did. But go ahead and cut those out all the way around. Oh, anyway, so, yeah, I got a whole bunch of cardboard projects. Just, you know, all kinds of fun stuff to make out of cardboard. And there's one more look at at that. See, in the box that I'm doing in this tutorial, I went all the way to the top of the box because it was my 9 inches that I wanted. But um, in, in the case of your box, if it's taller, just remove the top half. So do the drawbridge like this. All right? Don't cut the bottom of it so it'll act as a drawbridge. And in the back, you can cut the whole thing out. Or you could do it as a drawbridge, too. But now, the top flaps that you cut off the uh, box, do this to make them the three walls of the castle keep. And then glue them together. And let me think. I think that's about 11 or 12 inches in height. And then, the let me see. The side walls here are, I believe, 6 inches wide. And that front wall there is five inches wide. I think that's the num numbers I got. And there you go. Put some floors in there. Now, if you have miniature figures, little knights and stuff like that, you know, use them for scale so you can get a sense for how big you want to make this thing. And there you go. The keep goes in there like that. And your castle is pretty much done. Now we could go on to do some detail work, some various different things, like add platforms here for your figures to stand on in all four corners and walkways along that wall. I'll show you a little bit of that. But be creative. Have fun with it. And uh, one of the fun... And kids really love this project. You know, uh, the neighborhood kids really uh, have spent a lot of time with this. They just... It's, it's it's just out of a box. A box and some glue. And it just ignites creativity and imagination. So here's a few things, a few ideas. You can, um, you know, add windows. Put frames around those windows. Add um, a string to make the drawbridge. Let me see. I'll show you how I made it. 
because that way you can open the drawbridge and then you pull the string and it closes. So if you make this project, um, make sure you send me a picture. I will put it on my website and it will send you a certificate of contribution. And a couple more things. Now we'll look at some details here, but let's see. Now you pull the string and you close the drawbridge. Isn't that fun? Come on. Piece of string. All right, I set up cardboard box and some glue is all you need. Well, you need a piece of string too. Anyway, so YouTube is not what it used to be. YouTube now has pretty much um, neglected small creators like me. They don't want to share the money with me, so I need your help to keep my little home business going here. If you could think about supporting me in various ways. Look, oh yeah, look, fireplace. And add some stuff inside that, uh, that keep. A table, anything, a throne, pictures. Print up little tiny pictures and put them in there. Well, anyway, have some fun with that keep. Anyway, so YouTube, so I could use the support. Share this video on social media. Um, you know, share the link with different things if you like it. Um, send it to people you think might want it, like it. Give me a thumbs up. Leave some creative comments. Um, uh, support me on Patreon. I'll put links to all of this stuff in the description of this video, and I'll do some drop-down boxes too. There's another thing you can do is add a nice little tower on top and maybe a flag. Then have some fun and paint this thing if you want. I didn't paint mine. I just uh, to show it as cardboard. A lot of cardboard projects. Oh, here's one more thing. Now, if you have a castle, you may want to catapult to storm that castle with. There you go. I have a video with a template. You can download all the parts. Makes it very easy. Use a pencil or a paintbrush as the the um, hinge in this project and make yourself a little cardboard catapult. Simple as that. Thanks.